since before starting YouTube videos, I've one of the things I try to live by is be impeccable with your word. And so, like with that, it's I try to be like really good with my language that I'm saying what I mean to say. And one of the things that I've thought about with horse training is the word aid and the definition of aid, which means like to assist with something. But let me get the actual definition and put that here. Um, but I always think that the word cue is actually a better word for what we as trainers use for the word aid. Um, and cue means more to give a signal that the horse does something versus aid which means to assist with the horse doing something. But I just think that's interesting to think about because of the definition of the word itself. Um, people are always going to use the word aid and they mean something that is more like a signal to me than like a helping. So when somebody says aid for the canner, I don't think they mean assist with the canner departure. They mean signal the initiation of the canner departure. But anyway, it's something to think about. And I was teaching a clinic this weekend. Let's cut to that now and I'll catch you guys back up in a bit. So small, watch the clock ticking off the wall. But tonight I'm letting it go. Spend my coin for sure. I'm gonna be myself. Clinic is over. It was a good one. I did like 10 horses each day. Check out this barn. I hope, I think Sandra got some footage of one of the horses, her horse maybe, I can put that in here. But I gotta find out, so. It's actually that horse right there. His name is Wes. So maybe if I can get that footage, I'll split that in here and then we'll talk about it afterwards. Look at beautiful stars, I wanna drive a faster car. Lay my troubles to rest. Blow the smoke through my cigarette. City lights looking fine. And I know this is my time now. That looks awesome. I'm gonna be myself, or I could be someone else. No one's stopping me now. I'm gonna skip my breaks. I'm gonna make mistakes. Okay, so that horse is Wes, and I think it's really important to think about that. Like, I think when I help somebody in hand, like Sandra, um, how do I continue to refine the aids? And the aids come from the, the rider, but there's also a time to be a little more supportive. So like with the bamboo, just reshaping the front leg a little bit, helping them find the balance. Um, but I always think that's really important in hand. What's the balance between helping them find something and over time refining that where we can do less? And so I think about that. Um, but Sandra's doing an awesome job with that horse and I think I'm hopeful that horse keeps coming along and he's super talented so it's, it's exciting to get to work with him. If you look once more, there's a moment where I step in and help her on the long side but I'm always trying to have it be that if the horse is trying more or searching in the right direction that then I can ease off. Um, so support in a way to 
get away from using that support. In hand, I'm always trying to eliminate myself so that the rider doesn't need me anymore because that's the end, end result. I want, I want cues. I want really, really fine responses. Okay, it's way too hot in here to be vlogging without air conditioning. All right, guys, we'll see you later. So I'm on the 9.05 flight and there's a flight at 8.15. I'm gonna try to get on that flight. Hopefully I can make it and hopefully there's a spot. Looking for C3. This is us right here. Good evening, my name is Roxana and I'm working with Obar. Today we would like to welcome you to Alaska Flight 436 with service to San Diego. Each customer is allowed. I'm on the later flight. Is there any way to get on this or is it full? No, it's not full. Um, there is a charge. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is how I like to welcome aboard first class passengers in rows one through four for Alaska Flight 436 with service to San Diego. Yeah. Okay, great. Thank you so much. You are. This is the final call for Alaska Flight 338 with service to San Jose. All confirmed guests, please. I got on the flight. I bought me like an hour and a half earlier to San Diego. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. Will soon be cleared for takeoff. Please ensure your seat belts are fastened low and tight. Seat backs and tray tables are upright. Lock your periodic. Oh, 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 oh,